hello traders it's Samurai Trader here welcome to this recap how to day trade five trades for five winners traders the trades I'm about to run through with you you can trade any market using the exact same strategies and techniques whether you, whether you trade futures Forex or stocks now before we get to them I do need to pull up the disclaimer there is a risk in trading don't trade with money that you can't afford to lose and of course you're watching a recording here so we're not in the live trading room right now so you can pause the recording to read the disclaimer in full now if you haven't already please feel free to click on the description link below and download my free ebook the truth about day trading and make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can be kept up to date with all of my videos I release videos uh, new videos each and every week now very very quickly I'll make it real quick if you're not already a member for $197 what I'm about to show you you can get hold of 197 gives you all of my indicators doesn't matter which trading platform you have and now mind you when I say that there are some platforms that I don't have indicators for but I give you all of my settings so you can actually set those up there's over 200 hours of online instruction it's all right you don't have to watch them all I direct you on which ones to watch first and even better still you can join me for eight free private group coaching sessions that is twice a week 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. Tuesdays and Wednesdays I run two two hours or two hour sessions at a time uh, where I'm running through trades of a day how to actually trade the strategies and a whole lot of handouts we have in each session etc and that is basically priceless traders you can go to uh, my website and sign up for that for 197 a month if you wish but for 197 you get my entire program plus one month of coaching and if you can't attend the live sessions they are recorded so traders let's get into this now I know you've probably watched 101 videos on you know why traders fail etc but I do need to bring this up because I'm going to show you five out of five and it's this is fairly typical 80% win-loss ratio but I also do need to cover why traders fail using the strategies I'm about to show you it's called emotional discipline uh, Dick Diamond put out a really good book um, an excellent book called um, trading as a business and unfortunately most traders go and watch a YouTube video or read a, uh, a book and they think they're day traders and they go out there and they wonder why they lose money there's a lot there's a lot of moving parts traders and the reason I bring this up is then so many traders become jaded and they want to blame everyone for their failure the fact is there are some critical ingredients to the mix that make you successful as a trader and I'm going to point those out when I go I don't want to make this a, a war and peace video but I'm going to point these out when I get to the charts and show you the trades because I run two live trading rooms and my coaching rooms and I deal with hundreds of traders and I have hundreds in my classes and let me tell you with one-on-one -on -one, and I do a lot of one-on-one -on -one work and for a, when I do one-on-one -on -one, one of the big things we get into is the psychology of trading and that truly is 90% of trading now as Dick says in his book some traders tend to force trades when the odds are not in their favor you've got to learn to trade like a casino and that's a bit beyond the purpose of this video today and others have difficulty in pulling the trigger when a good trade presents itself so what I'm going to or what I hope to achieve with you is to show you what a good trade is and why it's a great trade and how to actually trade them now I want to, once again I want to keep this under 30 minutes so I'll try to be quick so today's session we're going to be looking at the micro NQ now I don't want to hear any heroes here think <laughs> and I've got to say this oh why why aren't you trying do showing me how to trade with big contracts traders trading the micros is what I get virtually every one of my new members to start on unless they're already very profitable and they're trading for large contracts you want to start on micros and build from there because as you're about to see you could become very very wealthy trading micros and building from micros and they're uh, very easy to trade low investment to get underway and even if you've got 50 or 100,000 the best spot to start now 
this also comes down to having the right tools and putting together a business plan and we'll be quick on this but one of the important things is that when we approach trade and we treat it like a business so the first thing is how much capital do we need and as a member by the way you get all of these spreadsheets but today we're going to be looking at the micro and Q we'll look at oil on other days etc but say today we're going to be looking at the 12 tick Renko and you can apply this to any chart now the 12 tick Renko uh, we never ever 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 risk any more than 2% did I say ever and so I'm going to assume here that you're starting off with $1,000 and as you can see um, well here you can get down you can get started with this as little as $650 and even on the micro we yes another great market even less than that but let's just allow a bit of a buffer and let's just say $1,000 you start with and I won't go through everything to do with this particular spreadsheet so if we start off with $1,000 in our account and here we're going to assume we never ever risk any more than 2% and what is a realistic daily target no BS what's a realistic target that you can achieve in say a time block of two hours now I'm also going to talk about um, or, or say to you when you day trade realistically you need to allow two hours at a time because sometimes you're going to a market it's dead for an hour that's trading we've got to wait apply emotional discipline and wait for the right setups so $50 as you see as you're about to see is really very realistic in this market now what this tells me if I start off with a thousand dollars go for fifty dollars a day within 18 weeks I have the potential of earning ten thousand dollars a week now the reality is is this that and down here it says that I would be trading 45 micros very quickly how this works and I know many of you have seen this spreadsheet is that you start trading an additional contract when you double your money so I'm being very conservative here you're earning the right as you go along you're developing not only confidence but something called competence at the same time so we start off with a thousand dollars fifty dollars a day when I double my 1000 get to two I can now start trading two contracts when I get to three I can trade three now the reality is once you start to get down to 10 micros you switch over to the big contract and you apply the exact same rule ten thousand dollars you're after 500 a day the micros are ten percent of the big contract now if you are already an experienced trader and you wish to apply my strategy uh, strategies uh, you'd start off with here with ten thousand dollars okay and you'd be going for five hundred dollars as a realistic target so five hundred a day that ain't bad is it that's five percent now the big thing is how do we do that but one other thing I want to show you which others don't want you to see if I can say others where are we here is it, come on you're going to come up let me quickly go to this where is it here uh, it's stuck here no there it is here it is here and it's this traders so if we're going to go for uh, $50 a day on the micro or $500 on the big contract um, how many trades a day do we have to execute to do that well here on the micro it's 50 cents what we call a tick or five dollars on the big contract your commissions a dollar twenty it can be up to two dollars depends which broker you go with I'm broker neutral so I won't go into brokers now your stop loss is 36 ticks that's eighteen dollars on the micro or 180 on the big contract and we're targeting basically the same on a one-to-one -one. and we won't get into trailing and all that thing today but let's just talk about really short-term day trading scalping and here if we worked on a 75 percent 25 percent win-loss ratio I need to execute six trades a day and that's very realistic using my strategies as you will see over a number of videos now so realistically I need to be allowing to execute six trades a day on average now you focus on that one trade if you can do it once you can do it again and again and again so typically four to six trades a day um, but we've got to allow for losses of course which that sheet allowed for 
so we're going to be looking at today's uh, trading and so today and so in front of members I'm trading usually micros because I'm training them on the micro so here I'll show you the exact result we achieved it was for two contracts 156 less commission so it worked out to be I think it was $11.60 or whatever it was in commissions but that's over $70 uh, and actually it was actually in 29 minutes so uh, but as I mentioned you allow a two hour time block you must do that because we only trade trendy markets now the other thing here is trade is that um, I will be showing you a number of different trades but what's very very important if you join me as a member I get you to focus on two or a maximum of two trades when I first start training new traders in the market or if trading hasn't been good for you up to now or good to you up to now we start by trading trend trades only and I want you to remember this the 34B and the 2B the 34B and the 2B why because they kick butt they're 80% trades now as Dick Diamond says if it's not an 80% trade don't take it and that's on that's his quote okay and we say basically exactly the same thing so you may be thinking why have all of these different setups well just like a tradesperson rolls up to do some work at your home or office they have a different tool for each different job so we're going to stick with well I'm going to show you some counter trend trades some uh, a couple of different setups I will show you however you start off by trading with the trend so let's get to the charts here so what I've got here this is some um, uh, on the Nasdaq now let me quickly expand this here so this is on the micro sorry my apologies and this is what we call a 12 tick Renko and, and you can apply this as I mentioned to doesn't matter whether you trade time-based charts tick uh, Renko is fantastic for new traders and also if you want to smooth out price action but it doesn't really matter which type of chart you use now the reason we're using 12 tick here and what that means is each one of these bricks here or candles is 12 ticks in size okay and we call these steps we step down now on this market when you're using a 12 tick each one of these steps is worth three dollars or on the big contract it's worth thirty dollars now don't think to yourself oh and let's just remember traders we say to ourselves oh is that all um, uh, you know three dollars a tick remember there were three dollars per step traders what I'm after here is just 50 a day and this is the thing you know everyone wants to get rich quick now that's hard because you make mistakes you are you you're undercapitalized but it's easy to get rich slowly trading correctly okay very important so we're after fifty dollars a day so number one rule is am I trading with the trend now I'm using ninja trader here and you can apply the apply the exact same rules and everything you see here by the way uh, I provide free to my members there's no charge for indicators uh, so if you trade with trade station you can set up the exact same thing etc um, and other platforms almost identical now here you can see we call this the cloud we're in an uptrend and here we're rolling over now this is 3 a.m. in the morning Central Standard Time we're leading up to the London open so I trade um, I've got a live trading room where we do 5 a.m. to 7 a.m. Uh, and I also do the New York close with some private clients as well so we do from 2 p.m. onwards and that's besides the coaching so let me walk you through exactly what you're looking for now see this blue arrow up here you've got one there you've got one here it's a very simple concept in how we identify a change in trend and we call that a t20 by the way okay so just remember if you're going to become a member for t20 and the very first setup there's one there and there's one there we call that the t20-1 all it means it's the first setup and there's logic behind all of these and by the way the white paint candle there it's called the super scalper okay so we've got our first potential trade there uh, down we come thank you very much now uh, when I'm trading in front of members I trade um, two lots and I go for what I call five steps on 
the first contract and seven on the second and the reason I go for five and seven I've just find that we it's very high probability we're going to hit those okay now you can trail and all sorts of things but I want you to notice the market sort of breathes and I love getting what I call the cash register to ring I want to hear it ring meaning you know I'm, I'm a scalper more than a, a, a longer term day trader or a position trader now you had a t20 there this is what we call a 2b so as we come down now I'm uh, getting ready for trading okay we're coming down and right there I had my first entry and that was what we call a 2b there now I'll just scroll along so we don't go for hours now uh, with this 2b it's a, a, a rules based strategy as all of these are t20s all of these are rules based and as Mark Douglas uh, states that the best way to master the art of day trading is to trade um, uh, pattern based rules based strategies and this is exactly what they are so when I'm trading these I'm saying to my members okay we're now looking for a retracement get ready get ready get ready ah here it is because it's a pattern that appears day in day out dozens of times and this is where so many traders go wrong they're not waiting for the patterns and waiting for the trends to set up no trend no trade no trend no trade I want you to remember that so there's our first trade down there okay and we get filled now something else that's absolutely critical and you've probably heard me talk about this in other videos and it's called the magic levels and um, there are predictive indicators out there now I've been doing this for 27 years traders and there are certain things such as these these are floor pivots these become predictive they're based on yesterday's price action they plot on your charts automatically and you know if you're with the trend into the pivot it's an 85 90 percent trade how's that for an odd 85 or odds 85 to 90 percent of the time you're going to give the pivot a kiss why so many traders particularly professional traders trade pivots you've also got your open high low and close and your major EMAs very simple to learn so first of all this is that one there and that one there are two of the key setups you'd learn one of the next ones here is what we call a t28 or a pivot magnet trade bang we come down and hit the pivot now that is an incredibly high probability strategy because you're being swept with the tide end of a pivot now we don't enter enter a pivot magnet trade up here well it, we enter here on the 2b but a PM trade a pivot magnet or a t28 we do it when we're a lot closer it's like a magnet okay you get a magnet you hold it too far away and it doesn't lift up the washer or whatever you're trying to pick up you've got to be close but that kicks butt down we come now we then come down here and let me resize this sorry everyone and now I get a 1d and this is something that I say to all new members do not even consider trading divergence I want you to ban yourself from divergence divergence is beautiful to look back on the left hand side of your chart after its form and say oh there was a divergence trade there was one there was one the fact is it's a lot harder to trade in real time I've been doing this a long time I love divergence but I also know when to fold them so I took this little divergence trade and I got out fairly quickly and I only got so many ticks out of that trade little winner but a mechanic rule got me out of that now I then have what I call a 2BD a 2BD is one of these 2B trades but it's after divergence and they can be trickier now this is mild divergence but I'm about to get major divergence okay so there's rules to why you avoid these but let's have a look at this now as we're coming down here I'll give you a little tip here's what we want to be doing now what I've got here this is called an entry chart and this is called an anchor chart there's a formula that I use for my entry what size anchor do I have 
and if I have an anchor chart too which I always do but I don't always have it on display what size is that so you've got for an example this one here is a 12 tick this one here is a 20 tick and there's a mathematical reason why we do that now see that there that was a 2b and this is a 2b now as we're coming down this little indicator down here is what we call a zero lag MACD and you can actually set this up on any type of MACD with special settings you can set this up and as we come down note here I've got this marked up as a 3d t7 a t7 and you learn the codes it's pretty they're all straightforward and there's abbreviations for all of them it simply means a double bottom or a double top a 3d means I've got three divergences I had one divergence for this trade now I've got three and do you know what that becomes that becomes a loaded trade okay so right now I've got a loaded trade so I'm going to take this as a double bottom 3d trade now my target on all 3d's or even 2d's is actually the 89 EMA which is the cyan line we don't always hit it but we usually do okay and up we go and I got my five and seven steps okay now on this five steps is fifteen dollars or 150 on the big contract and seven steps is twenty one dollars or two hundred and ten on the big contract now as we're coming up you can see we're heading up here to the pivot see the floor pivot pivots become magnets they also act as support resistance levels um, uh, and bounce points and so we come up with and now we've got our next potential trade now this just here traders uh, is also a pivot bounce to the short side it's not a pivot magnet trade because at the moment we can see our trend we're in a downtrend our entry chart is trending down our anchor chart is trending down sorry about the cough sorry just had some water then so you can see that we're in a downtrend um, so we were if we were buying into the pivot that's not a magnet trade a magnet trade must be with the trend but anyway just here now I've got what we call a 3b and I'm bouncing off three time frames and down I come thank you very much now in this case I've hit my plus five steps down here and I've gone to break even on my second just like up here okay uh, got out of this one it lifted my stop up and there's rules while you do that and I'm out of that trade and away we go from there now the ultimate what that actually meant was for the day traders I was up um, what was it over seventy dollars Per contract in under 30 minutes so that's over seven hundred dollars on the big contract and there's no difference except psychologically in trading the micros to the big contract it, uh, look if and I've got a lot of wealthy clients and and as I say to every one of them start on the micros because when you're small that's the best time to make as many mistakes as you wish okay but this is a business now after that you can see then we have trends now straight away what's our rule we want to trade with the trend so we're looking at both your entry and your anchor charts to to identify the trends okay now that was a 2b and, and by that time there we're in our live room running the room and just pointing out trades and discussing them as we're trading so traders this isn't rocket science what it really comes down to is mastery and screen time patience and discipline and this is not about intellect as I say to all traders but there's one thing you need to spend 90% of your time on it's not really mastering the setups and unfortunately a lot of traders will bahoo this boohoo this it really is about learning emotional discipline becoming patient and disciplined waiting for the trend if you're a gambler trading is not going to work for you 
okay um, you know this is there's no other business like this where you can create a part-time the full-time income and as you can see with under a thousand dollars it's an incredible opportunity however you've got to put the time into it on the screen and master your mind that's really important so traders as we finish up if you haven't already subscribed to my channel please do please request my video even better still for $197 um, go and look at the video what you actually get there's nothing else like it as my members describe my program as a gold mine and even better still when you come into the coaching room uh, you get to see exactly how to apply these strategies so traders I hope you enjoyed the video once again subscribe get let me get this out and I'll see you in the next video oh even better still in my coaching classes thank you traders